Here with a beautiful DIY to help keep wedding cards organized at the reception is Maria. Now, was this inspired by your own wedding? You know, it was inspired by my own wedding or lack there of planning my own wedding. Because okay. it was every every wedding has one detail that falls through the cracks. Mine was the card table or the card whatever situation. I decided to have a very beautiful place to have the cards for people to get their name places to sit at their tables. But apparently I didn't want gifts or anything because oh, I didn't have a place. No. And so it ended up being just a pile of cards and presents at And a, things a, will get separated and, and were, lost. I was like, did I? Did we have everything? And I had people texting me, did you get this? I don't know. Oh, so, boy. I was inspired by our very own mailbox wall because it is such a sacred place to us. Is where we get mail from our viewers. And seeing how beautiful that was, it inspired me for June Weddings to create a space for weddings to inspire our viewers to not forget a very important detail right. of your wedding are the cards because you want to get those little love letters from your guests. And you keep them forever and you put them in, in you do. albums. I have mine. Yes, I have mine. All right, let's get started. What do we do? I want to show you over here to get started. These are just wood crates that you get at the craft supply store. These started as those very plain crates. And what I did, I put actually uh, just a, a stain on the bottom. It's okay. more of an accelerator than a stain, and it turns it gray. And on top of that is just a dry brushing technique, you know, just dry brush and white paint okay. to create that really cool look that reminded me of the mailbox wall. So I have four crates here, and you just stack them like so. I would put something at the bottom that's going to weigh it down. So, Smart. And you can use some wood glue. Once you have a place, use some wood glue to, to keep get the everything together. on there. Yeah. And I got a little overzealous and got the big mailbox. Well, when you I had a lot of people at your wedding. It's understandable. You had a lot of guests. I, I did. <laughs> I, I actually don't even know how many guests I had at my wedding. But you want to make sure it's able to go down like so. And I found this really great little design. This says happily ever after. That was actually a cake topper I found at the craft supply store, and I thought Aww. that was really fun. And you fun. glued that there? Glued it there. This little sign that says love letters, just printed it out and you know, just a little triangle and folded it like that and cut the, so you have your, everyone knows this is where they put the little love letter. Did you do that with a pencil? Just a pencil, to, yeah. Just so take it and just roll it, right? We have one here we can show you. Just here, like so, and you kind of, you roll it in opposite ways so that it goes like that. And use the pencil for that. So it's like, like a know. pirate's flag for yeah. one of your kids' Legos things. <laughs> <laughs> you know, exactly. Yeah. That together. Now <laughs> this is a great way to incorporate some family heirlooms. If you have even just extra pieces of your dress or a piece of your mother's dress, I have a family picture. This is my mom and dad Aww. at their wedding. My grandparents over there. And to incorporate, granted, you wouldn't necessarily have your wedding picture, but since I'm already married, I put my Aww, wedding picture that's over so here. Sweet Maria. And you could put your engagement picture there. And it shows just to, I'm gonna put some of our cards in here. You can see this is exactly where they would go. Also, you can work with your florist if you really wanted to add some fresh flowers into this. You could work with your uh, florist and add in whatever flowers that go with your bouquet theme or, and your yeah, bouquet. Yeah, beautiful. exactly. Or you could go with the faux flowers because they're definitely more budget friendly and you can make sure that to have them prepped and ready ahead of time and then you just keep you keep decorating filling. where would you put this where would you place this at the wedding ideally I would place this where the cards are where everyone gets their name places for where their because uh, everyone has wasn't to so find fancy, out if, yeah you could have put it there exactly well, <laughs> but the thing is even if you do have a table for the name places this is your very own mailbox wall that you oh, have because it makes it special it makes those because getting a card where someone takes the time to write to you is so sacred and special like you said you keep them they become yeah, family they heirlooms and it's something that you can put in a book so to create a special place for that is so wonderful and you can always repurpose the crates I can I we 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 repurpose crates here all the we time. We really so do. Colin can even make a barn door out of them, right, Colin? Yeah, I probably could. <laughs> and look how fun these are too. The you can get the just how beautiful the uh, just metal metallic color of spray. So paint. is this one white? And that was both of these were white. Okay. Wow. And I just did a rose gold, added a little bit of jewels that I found Some in blank. our craft room. But you could use again a family heirloom in that type of situation. And if you didn't, if you didn't want to build, you could really just place this on a table too, if right. you wanted to do that. Well, I as love well. the placement of putting them where you get the cards because then everyone knows where it is too. Right. They exactly. have to go and get their card, and then they know exactly. where to go. And next. they're not searching for you. Where do I put this? Exactly. No, that was my wedding night. Everyone's like, it's so true. I have this for you. Yeah, that's so true. They all Thank walk you. around. You don't have pockets in your yeah. wedding dress. Yeah, no, I don't. Need you. <laughs> it's not a pockets in my wedding dress. But they should 